Hi kitty cats, I am Amethyst and welcome to my review of the NADS Nose Wax Kit. Now, let me get past the obvious question first. Amethyst, why in the ever-loving flying hell are you waxing your nose? Mmm, because as a transgender woman, I want every strand of body hair magically whisked away, except for like maybe my eyebrows, but those are on my face anyway. Oh wait, so is my nose. Mm. I'll figure that out later. So if you've never been waxed before, and I mean like for hair removal, not what that goth girl did that night to drink too much absinthe. If you've never been waxed before, here's how the process goes. Typically, they'll put on a little new age music, maybe some aromatherapy. They might give you an affirmation. Hey, you look great today. And then when you're sitting there, blissfully unaware, relaxed, they apply a little bit of melted wax to your skin, wherever they're going to do the waxing. This is usually somewhat of a softer wax. It goes around the hair so that as it cools, they'll put a piece of muslin some cloth on the wax, and then when they pull that off, the wax comes with it, the hair comes with it, and you're left with this really beautifully smooth skin, no hair. If you haven't had it done, I gotta tell you, there is really nothing that compares to really just the beauty of waxing. Okay, the process with the NADS Nose Wax Kit is just about the same, only instead of applying the wax to your skin, you use this uh, patent pending uh, handy dandy little applicator. So apply wax to the applicator, jam it up your nose, wait a minute, and then yank it out on your own to be disposed of in a somewhat demeaning display of your nature as a biological being. Otherwise pretty much identical to professional waxing. I don't know, maybe put on some new age music before you start. All right, so how well does the NADS nose wax kit work? Well, I mentioned before there was really nothing like waxing, and the case is true with your nose, too. Um, I used to have this little thing that you, not this, I used to have this little thing that, that would clip hair, but you know, you could only get it so short. Um, it's nothing like getting rid of the hair altogether. Personally, I didn't expect that there would be that dramatic of a difference, but there is. There really is. So one other aspect of waxing is that when you pluck a hair out of the follicle multiple times, sooner or later the follicle catches on. It says, look, you don't want hair there, I'm not going to grow hair there. So the hair grows uh, finer and less dense over time. So, you know, it's kind of a win-win situation. You get rid of it once, and then in the future, it becomes easier to get rid of it. Okay, so there are three important safety tips uh, to keep in mind when you're using the NADS Nose Wax Kit. Safety tip number one, don't get the wax too hot. I mean, this should be kind of an obvious one. You know, if it's gonna burn your skin, it'll probably burn the skin in your nose and nobody needs like blisters, you know, in your nose, okay? Okay, safety tip number two. If you have jewelry in your nose, take that out first. As it turns out, I, I didn't the first time I did this. Um, I wear a nose bone in my nose, so it doesn't stick out very much on the inside of the nose. And you know, the, the applicator doesn't go up very far, but you know, if you have a back on, on, the, um, on your nose jewelry, or if you have like a ring, take that out, all right? You know, it's, otherwise you might end up with somewhat uh, large injuries. Okay, and safety tip number three, do not use the NADS nose wax kit on broken skin. It doesn't make a difference. Maybe you get in a lot of transgender bar fights or Maybe you completely ignored safety tips one and two and ended up with blisters in your nose or large lacerations because you pulled the jewelry out. But if this is the case, maybe wait a week or two before waxing your nose. Okay, and that's it. Uh, that's my review of the NADS Nose Wax Kit. Personally, I love this thing. I give it uh, the amethyst a dingbat seal of approval. So, if you enjoyed this video, please hit like, maybe even subscribe, and I'll leave you with this piece of, of wisdom. Always be yourself, because nobody else does it quite as well.
Bye.